Hi, I'm Autumn Heisler and I'm the creative director of Dooling Media. Welcome to our second episode of Coffee and Content, where I'll be telling you things you should really stop doing on social media. Today we'll be talking about trend jacking. Trend jacking is when a brand hops on a major social media trend, like a trending hashtag or a national holiday, in an attempt to use that buzz to get people to notice your brand or engage with you. Trend jacking isn't all bad. When used appropriately, it's a quick and effective way to get in front of a new audience in the general online population. Don't try to be a part of a national holiday that has absolutely nothing to do with you. If your company sells frozen fish, you probably don't need to create a post about Memorial Day. And if you're an organization that sells chocolates and you're thinking, wow, MLK Day would be a great time to promote our sale, just don't. Please don't. If your organization doesn't have a direct and publicly obvious connection to a holiday, just stay out of it. Otherwise, participating is going to leave you looking seriously out of touch or worse. Don't start using a hashtag without looking up what it actually means. Go through the feed and look at about 15 to 20 posts to get an idea of what the general conversation is around a hashtag. Does your organization want to be affiliated with that conversation? If you're not sure, I would even recommend taking a few minutes to Google the hashtag. Look and see what kind of blog posts, articles, or other conversations are coming up around that movement. You don't want to throw out a joke on Twitter about frozen pizza when other people are discussing serious topics like domestic abuse. To wrap things up, if you're thinking about trend jacking, do your research or end up looking totally ignorant. Trust me, it's way easier to spend 10 to 15 minutes looking things up and finding out whether or not this trend is a good fit for your brand than it is to try to explain to people that your organization isn't really filled with insensitive idiots. Thanks for checking out this month's episode of Coffee and Content. If you've recently seen a trend jacking fail, share it with us. Otherwise, we'll see you next month. Thank you.